Um, Mr. Neal came and asked us um, if it would be possible to um, let some kids come down and do some work for us. And we really appreciate the help because this would be um, a project that we probably wouldn't get to on our own time. So kids are doing a really great job. I mean, it's really nice that Mr. Neal and all these kids wanted to come out here and paint for us and help us do it. For the students, I definitely think we're working with a lot of dedication and hard work and teamwork. <clears throat> like the boys right now carrying a whole bunch of molds it's taking a bunch of them so it's definitely all about teamwork and dedication because we're dedicated to doing this job with all that we have so i think it's great so i would definitely like to thank all of our administrators of caddo hills they're absolutely amazing always caring about our students and the mayors of norman mount ida and glenwood they are so willing to let us help we're not sitting in desks we're getting out outside I think that's a very good thing that not enough kids do nowadays and I just think that this will really show how community service can change our community. I think it's going to benefit the community because they're going to be able to come out and enjoy the their beautiful city park free of trash and sticks and our new playground the playground equipment having uh, mulch and so our community will actually be able to to see this and hopefully inspire members of our community to come out and do their own community service. From those folks that that are working for the cities uh, that we're helping today, uh, allow them to play some catch up and, and help the community in ways that maybe go on the back burner for them because they just have too much to do. It's really gonna help them uh, catch up and, and do, some, do some tasks for some other community members. They're actually doing some physical work and that's always good for anybody. Yeah, if you can get your hands dirty and get, get something done and accomplished at the end of the day, you can look back and, and uh, saw that you had a goal and you completed it and I mean it's, uh, and then just, you know, a grade on a paper. I mean, you're learning so much more by being out here, working together as a team, you know, seeing a problem and you fix the problem, you know, and, and uh, you know, going about just getting the resources that you need and, and then putting the time in to, to get the job done. I, I think it's great for them. Oh, it's, it's a, this is a great day for the historic Norman High. Uh, I spent my first years here starting in 1960s when I first uh, started going to this particular school and it was built, the reason I say historic, it was constructed in 1924-25 was when the first uh, students arrived here. It's good to hear laughter, it's good to see kids, it's good to see kids in the neighborhood, it's good to see kids in the square and in City Hall, it's just a great day for Norman. Now my mother and my aunt are both graduates of Norman High School. They're both up there on the walls inside and on the concrete down here. My aunt came back uh, and taught here actually in one of the little classrooms and was a class sponsor. She's on the concrete over there by the gym helping others. My mother and my aunt were big into giving back so uh, while my aunt was alive she was a huge supporter of the of the uh, Norman High School renovation and my mother as well. Uh, I think being able to work with the community helps you network with other people. It also just kind of helps yourself feel better because you are giving others the opportunity to see what you can do. Because we care about the community and it's important to get back to the community that gives so much to us. It's helping them to learn to, you know, to help their neighbor, to help their friends so that we just be a more kind community. I think it's a great aspect of uh, what we're trying to build here at Caddo Academy and uh, continues on our war path to excellence as Caddo Hill School District. Uh, you know, we are made up of multiple communities, but uh, we're the product of uh, a lot of hard work and determination from uh, people in our communities. And so having our students uh, contribute back and, and show our community how much that we care, I think is a, is a great activity for, for everybody to play a part in. Most of all, what we hope to do is uh, help students find the value in building community. Uh, in our area, in our region, uh, students uh, are what's going to be the future of these communities. They're going to serve on city councils. They're going to run for public office. They're going to uh, you know, lead school boards. They're going to possibly coach or teach on our campuses. Uh, and we want them to be mindful of the impact that each of them serve within their co own community. And so we want them to, to value that, see the, uh, see the opportunity there for them, and, and how much better uh, the community will be because of them. That's one of the great aspects about our, our tribe is how much our students and our staff and our community cares for one another. And, uh, and it was just awesome to see them give back.